Okay, pocket people. Look, we've got boxes galore and they keep coming. So I'm going to open some of this stuff. See what we've got here. Okay. more VMAX Climax packs. Now you might be wondering why do I get it in little boxes like this? Well as you know I do get giant boxes, cases of the stuff but I also look around the net and I see like private people and stores and wherever I can grab these little orders, these little deals where it's lower I can keep the price low and send it to you low. So that's why I get these you know little orders here and there as well as the big boxes. If you're wondering what the hell I'm doing, well, that's what I'm doing. Okay, what have we got here? Oh, and there we go. VMAX Climax. We have more VMAX Climax. Got to keep them in the box so I can check the tracking numbers to make sure that I'm getting the right product from the right people. Got to keep organized. Yes, I'm becoming a bit unhinged. All I'm doing on my run up to my trip to Australia is talking to people, ordering, talking to people, ordering, opening boxes, sorting it out. Because I have to get your orders out before I leave. Because so many people want pocket stuff before I go because they're starting to rely on me. Okay, here we go. 25th anniversary. Fantastic. Put that back in there. What do we have here? This is looking VMAX Climaxy. Yep, four boxes of VMAX Climax. Okay. There's a dude coming up the stairs right now, delivery guy with more. I'm hoping it's a case of being a Climax. There's so many people who want the Max Climax directly from Japan to, to avoid paying higher prices in their own country. Uh. What do we got here? Ah, Evie's Heroes, that's for a guy. Okay, put that back in there. A guy, a bloke, you get who exactly that's for. But this is how I earn my cut by searching around and getting the cheapest prices. Okay, we have a Fusion Arts. That's got to go out Monday. Put that over there. And... What do we got here? Another Fusion Arts. Okay, that's two Fusion Arts. Keep that all together. And that's it for now. Yep. But there's a guy coming with something, so I'll probably cut now and come back on video when he rocks up. Okay. Uh, so we did get another package. There's my knife. Okay, let's get this baby open. Whoops. with the pre-orders. Here we go, we have another chunk of VMAX Climax. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven here. Um, I'll put them back in here so I can double check which supplier they're from. So they're coming out to you guys. Um, anyone else who wants VMAX Climax and anything else Pokemon, um, as I've announced on the group and my page that I'm going to Australia from January 1st, 2022 to Feb 10th, February 10th. Um, that's unless COVID deep six is my, my, my trip back. So I'm looking forward to go back to Australia. I haven't been for over two years. So I'm sorry I can't help you out while I'm away. But, you know, I'm kind of going kookadook, uh, staying in Japan for too long. But um, we have a little window. Um, as long as I can get orders in and I can ship stuff latest the 30th of December, I can still shoot stuff out to you. But in general, um, it takes like one to five or so days for product to come to me after I order it. It totally depends because there's a couple of suppliers I use that um, they actually put the, the boxes through a, um, I forget what it's called in English. It's a confirmation. Uh, what do they do? They, they check for it. They check it to be genuine or something like that. They have some experts there allegedly and when anything comes in, they give it all the once over to make sure that the product is genuine and it's made by the Pokemon country uh, company and um, it's not some sort of fake stuff from China or whatever. So it takes a little bit of extra time for them to go through that process. So that's where the five days comes in. The order, the, the product goes from the warehouse to them. They make sure they ch check it first to make sure everything's rigid edge. Then they send it to me. Um, and for other suppliers, like when I buy it directly from the Pokemon Center or something like that, or some other, you know, uh, legitimate supplier, they often send it quicker. It can be as little as one day, but it's usually two to three days. So if you can send me orders in and you can ask me directly, you know, what the, um, the status is on which particular item you order, and I can tell you how quick I believe it's going to come in. But as long as we get stuff ordered by around the 23rd, 24th, something like that of December, I can get it shipped, I can receive it and get it shipped by, I guess, the latest, the 30th of December. So that's about all. Um, while I'm in Australia, you can talk to me. Um, <clears throat> we can talk about anything. Just I'm not physically here to, you know, check stuff that arrives to my house and send it back off. Um, until February 10th. February 10th is the earliest I could potentially, when I get back, you know, quickly pack things and send them off. So, like I was saying, we can talk about anything you want um, during the time I'm in Australia. I can get people up to speed with how we do it, the order process. I can even try to crunch some numbers um, and uh, try to keep the ball rolling in that way. But Crunching numbers too far in advance doesn't make a lot of sense. I can give you rough figures, but the um, the landscape is kind of, um, it's fluctuating the way prices come up and down, stocks go up and down. When something's building up to release, you know, price goes up and it releases and lots of companies that bought stock then suddenly dump it on the market. So the price comes back down. You know, there's, there's various things going on. Depends how many people overseas are buying it, how many people want it, Japan demand. It's, it's so complicated. So... I can't really just say like, you know, a box of this is going to be 8,000 yen forever, you know, get back to me any time and it's 8,000 yen. I don't know. I can get it more expensive, more cheap. I, I don't know. It totally depends. But that's all for now. Um, I've got some stuff to do and I've got to get out of here. So I'll catch you pocky people later. Cheers.